So to recap, what happens when we win or when we lose? If we win, we will go to a match at 7.30 CEST. Live after two warm-ups. All right, the two warm-ups that we're going. Um, there is another match being played uh, between Eclipse Pulsar and Good Focus. And if we win, we will play against the winner of that team. If we lose, we'll play against the loser of that team. Those Both those matches are going to be at 19.30. So, uh, in two and a half hours ish but that's not for a bit last warm up then we're going the format is the same as last week three maps are being played if you win two of those maps you will win the match and you win a map by getting five points um, before the other team gets five points really and the way you get points or the way you win a round is basically the same as the uh, matchmaking system first place gets six points second place gets five etc so if you get first and second place you cannot lose the round anymore, so you're in. I must bed super random, very late stream for me. All right, Tyler, have a good night. And thanks again for the raid, I appreciate it. Trident with the follow as well, thank you. I turned alerts off, people, uh, the sound of it, so I might see it a bit late, but I will reply. We are live, let's go. We're looking at Nats. For the other team, we have Gold, Headmaster Kill, and Ruark. Nats with a wide line here. Takes fifth place back though. Let's see if we can find someone else. We're looking at Roy right now. He's in fourth place. But Headmaster Kill and Gold are both in first and second. And for Team Molotov, this is not good. If, if they finish in this position, the round will go to a Someone just clipped. I think it was Experial who clipped and he falls down. That is not good. And the round indeed goes to Team Ace. First and second place is enough to win the round. Mime's Twitch got hacked? Wow. That's not cool. I'm gonna put this over here. There we go. That happened to Amaterasu as well a while back. Not cool. All right, we go back to the match. Nats in a good position right now. In first place, Roy also in a good position. Xperial has dropped down to fifth place. <coughs> Excuse me. Gold and uh, Headmaster Kill are keeping up though. Gold loses a bit of speed there. Nats and, oh no, Roy and Nats both seconds away from each other clipping and bonking and the round again goes to ace that was unfortunate they were ahead for most of the round Experial is who we're looking at now. Headmaster Kill and Gold, both with a good start. But Experial is keeping up. He's right there. Nuts also, good line. Ah, Experial misjudges the turn. And is going to lose a lot of time over that one. Ruark from Team Ace is uh, lagging a little bit behind. 0.4, the leader right now. Experial has a three second deficit, so he won't be getting a lot of points. Let's take a look here in the front. Oh, someone is taking the first. What was that? Someone jumped. Ah, uh, this is not a win. This is another win for Ace. I think it was Roy who, who, 
bumped on that ledge there, couldn't quite make the speed check. And flew, uh, flew out. The score is three to zero. Two more rounds and this first map goes to Team Ace if they keep this up. So let's hope Molotov can crawl back in there. Ruark with the weird line gets a bumpy transition is losing speed over that one. Headmaster killed, clips the inside, also losing speed. That puts, uh, let me see, can I find them? Nats and Roy in first and second place. Actually, Xperial is in third. Where is, I can't find them here. Xperial in third, this is good. This round goes to Team Molotov. Roy and Nats pull a good one out of that and take a round win for Molotov Gaming. The score is three to one. They just needed some warm up, you guys. It's fine, it's fine. We're good, we're good. Let's see if we can repeat that performance. Xperial had to release just a little bit right there. Gold in first place. Roy takes a good line. Gold with a with a gear down right there. Nats and Roy. Good lines. Roy does something weird though. Loses a little bit of speed there. Had to correct. Gold is going to take the win. Nats and Roy. Let me do quick math. No, that's not enough. Unfortunate. This round goes to Ace. They're on map point right now. They only need one more win. That was a very close round. All right. Let's see if they can... Snipe back. Headmaster kill with a mistake. Drops down. This is good. Because Golden Headmaster kill were in first and second position. And like that, they would just take the map right there. So that's not happening. Let's see. Roy and Xperial both in second and third place. It seems that Nats has dropped down to six. Here we go. Gold takes the win. Xperial and Roy. Ah, uh, this is another round win for Ace. First map goes to Team Ace. We have two more chances. If Molotov wants to win this match, we have to win the next map and the one after that. It has to be a glorious comeback. Let's see if they can pull it off. I will find out who the uh, next drivers will be and what the map is. Ace takes a first map and find themselves with one foot in the victory stream. Sam Kim, welcome, welcome. All right, I'll find out who the drivers are while they warm up. A bigger player pool than uh, the other team, clearly. But we'll see who's gonna be driving. The way it looks now, it's gonna be the same drivers that are warming up at least. So maybe it's just going to be the same. I don't know. The map is called Acheron by Azix. I find this finish so interesting for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know if we are live after the warm-up. 
or if we're gonna do something else. Remember, we're not live yet. We're going live right after the warm-up. Okay, so I guess we're taking the same drivers? No, actually, Zertzi is warming up. And Shocks? Zertzi and Shocks have swapped in. Roy is still, uh, appeared to be driving. And I think we have the same drivers for Team A's. The way it looks now. Zertzi bonks the finish. Well, you better get those mistakes out of the way in the warm-up. So that's actually great. Hey, Nax. Okay, we're live. Let's go. We're looking at Zertzi. For Team Ace, we have the same drivers. Headmaster Kill, Gold, and Roark. Someone clipped. Who was that? It was Roy. Roy has dropped down. Gonna lose a significant amount of speed. Almost a second behind. Nats, however, is driving strong in the front. Also Zertzi keeping up. Gold is in second place. Is trying to challenge Nats for that first place. But he clips. He screws up his line and he drops down. Which puts Nats and Zertzi both in the lead. Headmaster Kill is trying to snipe that position though and it looks like he is able to do that. Nats and Zertzi, but we win the round. Because Roy finishes in fifth place, which is enough. If he had finished at all, that would have been enough as well because first and third place gives you 10 and then you only need one more. So first round on Acheron goes to Molotov Gaming. Someone clipped right there. Who was it? I think it was. Uh, who was it? I'm not sure. It was Zertzi. Unfortunate. Roy has dropped down a little bit as well, but Nats is doing good though. He's in first place at the moment, but he needs his team to also get enough points or first place alone is not enough. Gold takes over first place though. Nats and Gold having a great battle here for first place. But Nats needs his team to finish and they will not have enough points for a round win this time. Ace ties it up. One to one. Here we go. Very technical map. Tight lines. Many places where you can bonk or grab an edge or a pole or anything like that. So a lot of practice is required. Or you just cannot do this consistently. Nats and Roy are... Ooh, na actually, gold from A's clips there. Nats and Roy are... Uh, in the front line. He Headmas, everybody I look at. Bonks. Let's not look at them then. Zertzi is in fifth place. But Nats and Roy are still in the lead. If they finish like this, if they can if they can do it. That's enough. Nats does not make the finish. But Roy and Zertzi first and second place so uh, the save was uh, instant we take the round didn't quite see what happened there because I didn't want to cast a curse them I 
think it was Zertzi who had a bit of an awkward line and lost some speed there. Let's see. Roy and Nats at the moment. Strong on this map. Holding first and second place. Zertzi with an awkward line. Touches the side. Gets that darned acceleration penalty and drops down. Gold has taken over first place, but Nats and Roy. Had Master Kill makes a mistake, can still finish though. And this is not a round win for us, unfortunately. Xerxes does finish, but uh, he would have had to be in fifth place for that to be a round win. Ace ties it up again. This map is a battle and a half. And we love to see it. <coughs> Excuse me. Gold clips the gap. The hole in the road. And we have a Molotov trio in the front at the moment. Although Headmaster Kill decides to poke his nose in. And ruin the Molotov party. I would like to have a different perspective. Here we go. Now we can see the field a little bit better. Headmaster Kill has dropped down again. Did he? He clipped because he's now a second behind. So at the moment, it's one, two, and three for Molotov. Don't screw up the finish. And that is an ace. Three to two. Love to see it. That's a good round. That's also good for your confidence. Knowing you can do it, you just have to keep your head cool and get those points in the pocket. We're looking at real Roy Boy, who is uh, doing well. At the moment, he's in first place. Let's take a look at Gold here, who is in second. This battle is raging. Interesting to see the different lines and, and different approaches to that drift. Gold gets nice speed out of this. Takes some time back. Actually, takes first place here. Uh, let's see. I Can I find Roy? Not sure. Gold takes first place. Nats, unfortunately, taking a last place. Wait. That's unfortunate. Did Nat swap in? I'm confused. Roy and Ruark fighting for first. Nats is still up there though. And he takes second place. In fact, he takes first place. Zerti is a little bit behind, makes an, again a mistake. So he will not be getting a lot of points today. I hope he can at least finish because that one point might make the difference. Nats and Roy in first and second place at the moment. Gold is following in third. The last turn, can he snipe it? Gold makes a mistake, which secures the victory in this round for Nats and Roy Boy for Molotov Gaming. We are once again in the lead, three to four. It is map, map point. If Molotov can tie this up uh, map wise, we will go to map three. If somehow Ace manages to win this map, the match is over. Let's find out. Gold clips. He drops down a few places. Nats and Roy and Xerxes are in the top of four. All of them. Headmaster Kill is trying to throw a wrench in their plans of getting first and second place. 
Can I find him? There we go. And Eclipse, so that's not going to happen. Nats is going to take first. Roy takes second. That is the map win for Molotov. And we tie it up. Nice. We go to map three to see who takes this match. Cool map. Also, this round was clearly more competitive than the round before. Molotov boys were very comfortable in this map. And it showed. Karlberg map. It's called Loophole. We've seen this map uh, last week and the week before a couple times already. Let's see who's going to be driving it. All right, Marina. We have some swaps from uh, Team Ace. Ras and Enos have swapped in. Gold is still driving, so he's driving all three matches. We have Roy, Nat, and who else we got? Nalex is going to be driving, it seems. I'm assuming we're going to go live right after the warm-up again. So this is warm-up one. It's about to end in three seconds. We have one more warm-up where it's about enough time to drive one lap. And then we go live immediately. Alright, let's see. Nalex, who has, uh, was driving his first map today. But he has been able to warm up. Gets a no slide there. Good luck, have fun. This map is the tiebreaker. Whoever wins this map wins the match. So it is all or nothing. We're looking at Roy. For Team Molotov, we have Nats, Roy, and Nalux. We have Gold, Raz, and Enos for Team Ace. Very narrow section there. Always very scary to me. Roy has to release a little bit to adjust his line, but it doesn't seem to lose him that much time, though. Which is good. Get some air time. That does lose him some speed. Gold takes advantage of it and takes over third place. Oh, what happened there? Nalox, I think hit a wall and loses some speed uh, let's see is this enough if he finishes it is enough yes he does Nullux takes the sixth place which gives them exactly enough points to win the round we are in the lead one to zero on map number three this map is the decider for the victor of this match And there you see the importance of finishing a map. Even if you're falling behind, get that point. Because otherwise this would have been a draw. Nats, Raz there, right there, uh, touches those borders. 
which puts Roy in second place. He inherits the second place. Nolix is in fourth. Can I find him? There he is. Gold is trying to snipe that second place. Nolix unfortunately crashes the inside of that corner there. Gold messes up the finish, or the, uh, the last to jump to that checkpoint. Nats and Roy secure first and second place. Once again, this is a win for Molotov. Which puts them two points ahead of Team Ace. We're looking at Roy. Has to release a little there. Puts him in the last place, it seems. No, it puts him in fifth. But anything can happen here. These lines are different, so checkpoints might be a little distorted when you see I but that does cost him some time when he had to release that and correct his angle Nalux has dropped to fifth place R Nats took over first so that's good because you do not want the opposing team to take first and second place so Nats actually sniping the victory here is this going to be enough it is going to be enough because Nalux is in fifth and Roy is in fourth, so that gives 11 points to Team Molotov, which puts them three points to zero. Two points to go, but let's see if they can do it. Nice line there by Roy, really tight. Gold also with a good line. Gold consistently uh, driving these uh, first, second, third places. But also, Nats and Roy are really keeping up. Nice line by Roy. Takes over first. Let me see here. We're looking at gold so we can see what's in front of him. And what we see in front of him are two boys from Molotov Gaming. The last turn... Nats and Roy don't make a mistake. They don't, and they secure point four. Nalux, fourth place. Enos in sixth, Raz in fifth. But as we know, if you take first and second, that's enough for the victory. We are on match point. One more point to secure the match. One more round win for Team Molotov is all we need. And that sounds easy, but it's harder than you think because a mistake is easily made. Keep your nerves together, and let's do this. Gold does not keep his nerves together. Clips the side. Loses a lot of speed over that. We see Nalix with a very tight line. And that gain gains him one spot over Enos. Roy and Nats at the moment in first place. Raz is trying to do something about that because he knows if they finish like this and it is an ace in the last round the Molotov boys win in style we win in style and secure the victory G G that is a win for team Molotov right there Speed Self with the raid. Thank you so much. You were just in time to see uh, Molotov win their match. All right, let me take a look at the bracket real quick. Here we have the master sheet. How is your stream, Speed Self? And thank you so much. All right, let me change the scene here. There we go. Let me get a little bit bigger. There we go. Okay, so this was the match that we've just played. Ace versus Molotov. We have won that match, and... This was match P17. The winner goes to uh, this match. 
And as we can see here, the winner of this match was Good Focus. So that will be our next opponent. And that match will be played at 7.30. The match will be played at 7.30. And um, Ace will be playing against Eclipse Pulsar at that same time. We will be casting and watching and witnessing this match right here. Uh, this is the placement for the spots 25 to 32. If we win that one, this is P29. We will go to this match right there at 8.30. If we lose P29, it will be this one played at the same time. And we'll be playing against whoever is in this match but we don't it's one of these four teams we don't know yet quite who that's going to be 730 